The Nevada Health District is reporting the Latino community as the group that is hit hardest by the coronavirus outbreak. The department is now ramping up testing available to this specific demographic in an effort to keep those numbers down. Sasha Loft is now joining us live from the Health District with a bit more on details on how they're making all that happen. Hi, Sasha. Good evening, Brian. Elected officials and the Southern Nevada Health District want members of the Latino community to know that testing is available here in Southern Nevada, no matter your socioeconomic status or your ability to pay for that testing. Now, the latest numbers released today show our local Hispanic community has seen 27% of our total COVID 19 cases. That's just over 1,300. Health officials say this is related to many Latino community members living in close quarters with multiple family members and are less likely, many of them, to work from home. They want Latinos and really every member of our entire community to know that testing is becoming more readily available by the day. Now that there's been an improvement in the availability of these tests, uh, anyone with symptoms can be tested. Anybody who is suspicious of having come in contact with a case of COVID can be tested. And those that have no suspicion or symptoms can also be tested. Now, medical officials also mentioned a lack of health care options through the Latino community here in Southern Nevada. Now, they also talked about a drive through testing site at the Orleans Hotel. It's really available to anyone, whether you are a citizen or not, whether or not you have health insurance. And it is free if you don't have the ability to pay. You can register through that, or for that rather, through UMC. For now, reporting live at the Southern Nevada Health District, Sasha Loftus, 8 News Now.